Welcome to template-board.com. In this video we'll show you how to get started with your first dashboard. Once you downloaded your desired dashboard, you will see 5 to 6 charts and KPIs. Every quadrant is designed to present you relevant information for your analysis. In the upper section, you will find different slicers, which will help you to filter your data in a dynamic way as if you were using a business intelligence tool. Every click on the filters changes your charts, and you can start making different analysis depending on what you want to see. For example, when selecting the customer art at fashion, the middle chart will narrow down the results of this customer. When you open up your downloaded file, you'll see that it comes with sample data charts. Every file will show you three different spreadsheets, dashboard, which will show you the charts and KPIs, charts data, which will show you the pivot tables that make your charts change dynamically. And data, which contains your actual data set. The first step to customize your dashboard is to select all the sample data and delete it, that's where you will paste your actual data. The second step is to identify the fields in your actual data that are similar to the fields in your downloaded dashboard. In this example, the field purchase order number is equivalent to the order ID field and the other fields also have an equivalent field on the data spreadsheet. Once you have identified equivalent fields, copy the data from your actual data source, and paste it on the table of your downloaded dashboard in the right column. Do this for all the fields. Once you're done with the copy and paste process, you may go to the dashboard sheet. Click on an empty cell on that sheet and press Ctrl plus Alt plus F5 to update the charts. Now the dashboard displays your actual data and you can start making your analysis and improve your decision making with templedashboard.com.